Anthony Snyder here to demonstrate the Snyder method for solving a Rubik's Cube. Mixing it up. Trying to mix it a different way every time I mix it. Go at least 40 or 50 turns because humans cannot turn randomly like a computer. Otherwise I could do a mix with 20 turns. Okay, here's my mixed cube and my first goal is to get a 2x2x3. Two by two by I'm seeing this is already very easily matched with that. This one's already in place. Um, to benefit from that, I'm going to need to get this piece over there. And this one and this one. Uh, well, then I have to go with this one. Okay, can I get all that once or not? Let's see. Uh, yeah, I think I could do all of that at once. Okay. So I go like this, and notice that gets those lined up, that lined up, and that lined up. Now, I'm going to go like this. That gets these lined up. This here, I go like that. This is like a 1 by 2, 1 by 2 by 3. This, like this, now, Sometimes I do a little opportunistic move there, and I actually got the first two layers done minus a corner edge all at once. That's an, the, uh, what, it was really a, a CE that I saw that I could pull in at the same time with an extra two turns. That's all that was, because uh, I was really focused on the 2 by 2 by 3 Now, I'm going to get these in like that. And the last layer, I'm going to get all the edges in and one corner. This corner is real easy to get in at the same time. Going like that. And then the three corners. Like that. So it's very few turns using this method.